Hello my beautiful Capricorns, welcome back on my YouTube channel Ivana Tero and welcome to your weekly Love Tarot reading. It's the first week of May 2022. Let's see what will happen with your love life. Sit back, relax and have some fun. This is your first message Capis. Let me see. Family, friends and your guides. What a beautiful picture. What a beautiful tarot card. So there is another message. Spirit. So this is your spirit guides or also could be your higher self. We will see exactly what this card represents for you. But, you know, I like this, you know, family and friends and guides. Okay, so let's dive in your love tarot reading. And maybe this is you building your family. Maybe you already have a family and your children and your spouse. Or maybe, maybe you will meet somebody with whom you will be able uh, to build a family. Also, I can see already there is a friend, at least one of them, being interested into you. Let me see what this person want to say to you. In time, I love you even more. So I only can conclude, many of you are in a beautiful relationship already, probably having your family, children, uh, you know, and this person obviously loves you more and more. Right away, before I proceed, I need another message. Let me see. So all in all, your partner is deeply in love with you. Let me see another message. Let's party. You and me, I want to travel places with you. You are my best friend. I respect you. So obviously there is more and more and more love coming your way and it's very interesting you know but this is you know best uh, it could be so your partner is your best friend you see what i'm saying for those of you who are single probably you will party you know never mind you know the cause the reason but it looks like you will be in a, in a good mood you will be in a good mood some of you will have opportunity to travel because it's written. But basically the key moment is you are my best friend. I respect you. In time, I love you more and more. Wow. Hoo -hoo. It's so nice you know, to start Tero reading with such a beautiful messages. Now, please, Capis, remember those three Tero cards. Because I'm changing my deck once again. Now let's dive together. And let me see who they are. And what will happen next? Page of Wands. Passion and optimism. This is what you can expect. A lot of passion and a lot of optimism. So you are, you will be in optimistic mood. And this person could be Aries Leo Sage. If you are single, get ready. This person could be a little bit younger than you are. Don't be distracted with age of this person. Could be six months, could be three years, could be five years. Never mind. This person probably will be very playful. But this person only can bring you a good news. Let me see another message. So pay attention for now at least, Aries Leo Sage. Three of Swords, Heartbreak and Suffering. Okay, what is going on, Capis? Do you suffer because of someone? This person could be Aquarius, could be Libra, could be Gemini. Maybe in your world, maybe, maybe not every single day is a perfect. But guys... No one world is completely perfect. So three of swords could be some, could be some, I don't know, not like a fight, more like uh, not understanding one another, but everything will be good. This is why you have passion and optimism as the very first card. 
So keep it light, you know, don't be harsh uh, on this person. Also, this could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, as your ex person who do suffer because of you. You know, Three of Swords is a nasty card, which talks about emotional healing, being sad and being concerned about something. Maybe finally you need to break free of your previous relationship inside of your heart and both inside of your mind. Four of Swords, this is so good to get in your reading. Four of Swords after Three of Swords because I can see drama and this, <clears throat> excuse me, tension will release. So this possible fight, misunderstanding and you know whatever, it's going away because I can see restoration and you need to take a break, do something for you, go out, have fun, visit with your person, museum, restaurant, disco club, um, theater, you know, do something for your soul. So still, I want to remind you, family, friends and your guides. So do something for your, for your well-being. If you are in the middle of a breakup, my advice probably will be completely the same. Museum, theater, painting, talking with your friends, with your you know, family, and, and doing something for your soul, for your, for your spirit. So try to upgrade you know, whatever you do in your free time. Do that and do that more. Whatever suits you. So some of you... Maybe if you're going through a breakup or maybe you are nervous about anything at all, rest and withdraw at least a little bit. So what I'm saying, quiet your mind, don't be so harsh on yourself or maybe on this person with whom you are dealing. Two of Pentacles, I think after some time this person will adapt to you. So it looks like your reason, your rules, your ideas, whatever you want to achieve, probably it's on your side. So after some time, this person will become more flexible. I think this is also a week of compromising and it looks like this person will adapt to you and your ideas. Could be family life, could be some investment, something something of that kind could be some situation with your family with elders inside of your family so this is this is it looks like at least for now week for talking week for adaptation and becoming more flexible than before maybe you have such a big expectations maybe this person is too playful maybe this person is not that very serious for those of you who are single, get ready. I can see two people uh, interested into you and they are completely different. They are completely in opposite from one another. One person is more calm and another person is much more outgoing. Most likely Capricorn Virgo Taurus or um, Eris Leo Sech. So could be you choosing between two people. So you can be you can be confused for a couple of days if you are still choosing you know first of all how come two people want you and will you choose between your best friend and someone completely new this is up to you nine of swords regret your ex regret someone have such a big regrets maybe this person still want you back but i think you already moved I don't think you will I don't think you will uh, get back maybe even you don't think that much but I can see a lot of regrets <clears throat> a lot of regrets three of swords nine of swords regret suffering heartbreak crying being you know very very sad so there is at least one person who can't stand being without you 
they can't stand being without you. But everything depends on you. So withdraw and think what you want to do next. So I mentioned this person a little bit probably younger than you are. Eris Leo Sag, but also on the other hand, there is another person, Capricorn Virgo Taurus. So you can choose Earth or Fire element. And I think this person is very close to you. Maybe both of those two people are your friends. Maybe both of them are your friends. Okay, let me draw another card. And I will remind you on those first three messages. Knight of Pentacles, efficiency, love. Soon this person will become so dependent on you. Now, let me show you, Capis, this is very important. In time, I love you even more and more. So either this is your spouse, partner, falling in love with you again, or simply loving you more and more. Or this also could be your best friend. Do you guys remember? You are my best friend and I respect you. So this is what it is. So listen your intuition, li listen your guides, family and friend. Your friend could become your family as well. You see, Capis, what I am saying. So more or less, you know, this is what it is. And if you've been single for quite some time, this person will admit feelings. This person have a lot of feelings for you. Maybe this person waited for you to come out. Maybe this person watched you for quite, you know, like many, many months you and how much you suffered because of, you know, breakup with your ex. But now everything is gone. You moved on and this person simply will slip into, you know, this place instead of your ex. Never mind. I can see you being very, very happy. Comment, like, share, subscribe. God bless.